welcome back to my channel. Today I'm actually bringing you a Poundland and One Below haul. I haven't done one of these in, it feels like forever, um, but I have a lot of stuff equally amazing from Poundland and One Below. One Below has become one of my favourite shops just because I can find stuff for 79p and I'm like, yay, I've got change out of a pound. Um, yeah, okay, so let's get on with it. Um, Jumper is Nasty from... Nasty Girl. And it's one of their loungewear sets. It comes with these gorgeous little shorts that are, that have the same pattern. But yeah, I just thought I'd let you know before I start. And before I actually start showing you stuff, please don't forget to hit the like, like button and the subscribe button because it makes me really happy. Okay, I'll start off with this because it's on the table for some reason. My mum actually picked this up from the pound shop. From their Christmas section, it's just this cute little wreath. Rattan wreath. I was thinking maybe I could jazz this up with some glitter and some sparkly bits nearer Christmas. It's grey. It comes in white as well, I think. But yeah, it's the grey one. Um, and it comes with a little hanger as well, which is really nice. And a little hoop. So yeah, that is from Poundland. These are more suited to the season. These are the bird cages. They had these last year, but they were bigger. This year they're a bit squat, but I'm thinking, guys, I'm thinking I might do a DIY for the wedding. The wedding, I keep saying wedding, it's a vow renewal. We're having a vow renewal next year, September, on our 10th year anniversary. And I was thinking maybe spray these white and have like baby's breath in them with a LED candle on the table. So yeah, pound each, and I bought two. I might go back and get another two, just to have uh, more. E yeah, yeah, more. Oh, I have no idea what I'm saying. So yeah, I bought two of those. Other wedding stuff, I got some of these wooden confetti, and it's just, um, they say love. You wouldn't think it. It doesn't look like love on certain angles, but it just says love and there's 40 pieces in there. So I thought that was really pretty. Um, I think I'll only buy one because I might just use it on the cake table. Because you know, a party has to have cake. So regardless if it's an anniversary party or not, it's good to have cake. Um, I also got some of these butterfly pegs. There is 20 in here, um, pack of 20. And they're these gorgeous little wooden butterflies. I don't know what I'm gonna use these for yet. But they will come in handy for something because we're not having a like a sort of any sort of seating plan. <clears throat> Excuse me. So these will probably just be used for old wedding photos uh, from our our wedding. So that would be really cute. Uh, also picked up this gorgeous sign. It says wedding though. So I might paint over it or spray paint it with this paint that I got, chalk paint, and have this way or sort of like a party instead of wedding because yeah it's a little bit wedding -y, isn't it um not only that i don't really like the color of the sort of like the beige not not keen on the beige is that too um, am i too i feel really orange <laughs> sorry i'm looking at the mirror thinking i feel really orange but um, yeah, that's the, it's a wooden arrow and it is lovely and it comes with the, the twine that we're going to be using on the day anyway. For a DIY. Ugh. It's just these uh, A, sorry, A5. They're four by six photo frames and they come in packs of two. I've opened them already, um, but they come bound like this. Um, but I bought three packs just because I'm thinking... I'm going to make a some sort of lantern or bars out of these. My mum's done one already, but um, I'm gonna have to get her help or watch a YouTube video. Um, but they're just these little a uh, four by six uh, photo frames with the backing on them as well. Two pack for a pound, perfect. But yeah, um, the, the, the lantern will sort of go like this and I don't know where to put photos in the frames or keep just glass um so you can see through we'll see i don't know what i'm doing with that yet i just bought them just so i have them so yeah i bought three balls of these they're 
the yarn, obviously you know that these are three for two. I've bought them before. These are to finish off a baby blanket I'm making for my neighbor downstairs. Um, not sure if they're the same colors, colorway. They must be, it's just that they're wrapped differently, but I did buy three of them. I'm using one already. Yeah, three for two, not too Loads bad. Loads of these in the bathroom and scattered around the house. But the eucalyptus leaves will always look gorgeous in any vase. Not only that, I'm thinking of doing a DIY with them. <clears throat> I have a few embroidery hoops that I want to make pretty with flowers on one side and, and these leaves are really cool for that because they stand on their own and they're, they're just gorgeous. I love them, I love them. This one doesn't look so, so healthy. If you can see that, can you see that? That does not look too healthy, does it? With my hands, you know, you see that bit there? It's a bit, um, uh, it might, might not come out the mould properly. If you don't know already, get to know because I love Halloween. Okay, <laughs> the next thing I've got is these. I think these are really cool. They're just glitter candlesticks. They were all battered. I'm not sure what happened to them in transit or whether they were just made poorly but i love them it's got the led light flickering light on the end and they stand well on their own they come with like little tiny feet and on and off button and they probably take those flat batteries that watch like watch batteries oh this one's still got the uh tab in so i'm not going to take that out um you could actually pull that off What's the point light up candle from the Halloween section but I thought these would be really great for Halloween Christmas even I could cover them again in glitter Ooh. Ooh. Hmm. anyway yeah so that was those I'm going to turn this off now because I don't want to have to change a battery but yeah pound each really really good very very Halloweeny really good for a tablescape actually I could make um, a really nice Halloween tablescape for the kids because they sit in we sit in here and eat obviously dining room um the next couple of things i bought were the two pound things where is that gone Ew. furniture paint chalk finish uh from the print factory paint paint oh my god paint factory factory i can't speak today i bought the chalk white just because i have nothing in the house that's green or peach i think the other color was but we'll see how this this goes. This is a smooth touch flat finish, flat matte finish, chalk finish. So it's really good for furniture. But I thought it might be really good for these uh, bird cages as well. So we'll see how those go. So you'll see me use these Ooh, in a DIY. Um, I'm so childish. I'm so sorry. But yeah, two pounds each in the DIY. Two pounds as well. This is one of the jumbo storage bags they do. Um, this was it actually in the, um, like, do you know the back to school area? Like back to college, uh, where they set up their own home. So they had the bed sheets, rugs, bathroom uh, mats and stuff like that. This was in there. And it's just um, uh, one of the big giant storage bags that you can get. But I thought it was prettier than having loads of different bags. Just put it in this and it would look a little bit nicer um, and this is just the black and white one they did have another design but I'm not sure I can't remember what it was and this is the spray clear varnish this was a pound those ones two pounds this was a pound I was thinking um, I'm gonna cover a mirror in glitter and I I don't own hairspray I mean I've got afro hair I don't really use hairspray um, so I bought this one instead this is the uh, yeah clear clear varnish Durable, quick drying, and easy to use, and it's a clear matte finish, so that's good. Um, yeah, we'll test it out and see how I like it. Um, anything else in the pound shop? Yeah, nice. this I found in the pound shop. This is the same, was in the same section, also I bought by Paint Factory, but it's that like you add it to paint or wood varnish and it creates a glittery wall. Sorry, can you see? I'm not sure if you can see that. I'm going to bring it back. Uh, <laughs> let me just, let's focus, focus. There we go. So yeah, paint glitter. 
and I just found it randomly in the kids section. So someone had put it down and dropped or dropped it. But um, I thought that was really cool. But we've just decorated the kids' room. This would have been perfect in the girls' room. You'd probably need another couple of packs to cover four walls. But I just thought that, I mean, I could use that in a DIY as well and cover another. I've got so many mirrors to, to paint. But um, yeah, I thought that was really cool. And it was only a pound. So yeah, adds a delicate sparkle when mixed into paint or wood varnish. So perfect. Ooh. Um, another pound shop item is the pillar candle, flickering battery operated LED candle. I already have one of these in my beautiful new pink lantern from b and I will show you a picture here maybe. And this is gorgeous. I love this. I think, oh, I've got one here as well. Oh, can I open this? Da -da -da. Yeah, here. They are gorgeous. If you haven't seen these already, these are a very good alternative to um, obviously the plastic, the proper candles because they look really real, but they're not. And you can stick that back in the cupboard without setting fire to the place. And they take uh, three triple A, triple, triples, three, yeah, three AAA batteries they take in the bottom. Good for weddings and crafts, like, you know, flower arrangements. <sighs> yes, beautiful. Okay, next. Uh, palm olive pampering clay body wash. Purification with natural moisturisation. And it smells freaking amazing. It says gently purifies. I want it to roughly purify me. Purify me. Um, but yeah, it smells gorgeous and... I thought I'd try it. I've never, I do love palm olive, but I've never tried this before. I've never seen it before. So I'm gonna give it a try. Some more diamond gems. Guys, you know how much I love these. Um, it's just the ones from the wedding section. I've used these in a couple of DIYs already, but I thought, let me just get some more because they are so beautiful and they keep on selling. So yeah. Oh yeah, boring stuff, but still, you know, no words needed. If you've watched every other Poundland haul, you'll know that no words are needed. Um, I got some Clean and Fresh Fairy, uh, Pomegranate and Honeysuckle, yum, yum. It smells, it smells really good and really fresh, so I'm, I'm in love with that. Uh, okay, so I think that was it from Poundland, uh, one below. And I'll start with this brush. We bought the kids Smiggle fold up water bottles and they're like rubber um they're bpa free but they are annoying to clean because you can't grip them and wash them properly so i bought a bottle brush with a soft head to get in there and um my friend actually recommended bicarb soda and water and just shake it so i'm going to try that as well um but yeah uh, <laughs> bottle brush uh what else i've got a suit bag I bought this actually for the dress that I'm wearing on our vow renewal. I bought two. I will do a video on those nearer the time. I just don't think it's, you know, necessary to do it right now. But I am excited to show you guys. But I don't know how long this is. But I thought I could just roll up the dresses on top of the hanger and just hide them away from hubby. Even though it's not a wedding, I still don't want him to see what I'm wearing. It's actually 96 centimetres long, which is like a it's quite long actually so um we'll see about that uh what else what else what else guys what else more yarn these ones were 79p from one below 79p and look at the colors they're very eastery colors but they're gorgeous for baby blankets and they've got this fine glitter in them as well i hope you can see that but I think they're gorgeous and the pink, so pretty, so, so pretty. So yeah, if you're making a baby blanket or a gift for a friend at Christmas, these are perfect. And like I said, they're very Eastery colours. All you need in there is a yellow and, a, and maybe a mint green. You've got Easter. It's really, really cute. Um, and these two were a pound. These are like the soft, plushy fur. Like they're so nice. Upside down too. Um, so I bought the baby blue and the baby pink, but also good for making crafts as well. 
um, for like wrapping things and things and stuff and things. Uh, I've wrap. got some craft glue. Um, the probably Wednesdays, yeah. I've got another DIY of Wednesday coming up, so this will be used for that. These are a pack of two, and they're the clear, um, clear glue. So we used to use this all the time at school. Yeah. Household gloves. I bought Hubby an extra large because he likes a bit of space, and <laughs> he can never take them off once they're hot, like once they've been used. Um, and then I got myself a medium. They're actually a pack of two. Most places only sell like packs of one. So yeah, a pack of two for a pound. Gloves, marigolds. Um, I got some combs. I can never find combs. There's six in here and it's an assorted set. Um, the ones from the pound shop, I will admit, are a bit flimsy. Now, I've had these ones from One Below before. I don't know what I've done with them all. Sorry, I'm just torn open the box before I've even showed you. It's, uh, yeah, it's uh, that one. And there's a set of six in there. But, like I said, the ones from the pound shop, you, you open them, they're really flimsy. You could, like, bend them and snap them. But these ones seem quite sturdy. They're not very, like, they're quite stiff. And when I'm doing my straightening my hair I need something to guide the straightener along and the ones from the pound shop are really flimsy and they sort of melt and pull on my hair so um I'll give these ones a go again see if I don't lose them this time <laughs> uh more household stuff got some dishcloths pack of five that bit boring I'm sorry um I got some arm and hammer uh extra white for brighter whiter teeth Baking soda, toothpaste, love it. It's always been my favourite. Um, I got some Johnson's cotton buds. They're the 200 pack. Really good deal. Baby cotton buds, me. Uh, yeah, 200 buds in there. So kept one good of these deal. back. I bought the kids a bunch of these. Uh, these are the Shopkins Pet Kit Happy Places Rainbow Beach. So it comes with like a table or a chair and all sorts of cool stuff and a little pet. But um they're a pound in one below but they always have blind boxes and blind bags the kids absolutely love all that stuff if you do follow my daughter aria's antics you'll see that they absolutely love these so i kept one back to show you but i did buy about six or seven eight no eight because i made it even um i got this weekly planner don't know when i'm going to use it but um i do love it it comes with a little like little strap. Let's open it for you. Ooh, I'm excited. Um, yeah, it comes in that nice little gold and the cover's blush pink. And it comes with the two sides and a pen holder in the middle. So you've got to-do list and, well, Monday to uh, Sunday and shopping list on the other side. And I'm assuming you can just tear these off, yeah. Just tear them off as you go. And that one, yeah, you just tear off. But I thought for a pound, it's not, not too bad. And it's really nice and compact as well. I could actually stick that in one of my bigger handbags and take with me if I need to. Um, but yeah, I just love the colours as well. The grey, the pinks, the, the, the copper. Really cute. So if you're an organised person, not like me, um, then yeah. The last thing I got, guys... Oh, no, I've got a hoop to show you as well. But these are going in one of my DIYs this week. I absolutely love these crystals. You'll see that I use them in my glitter, my tray. I've got like a, a whole bunch of these just all stacked up. It's so pretty with lights in there. Um, these are the scatter crystals from One Below. Um, the ones from the Poundland, they don't really sell them um, much anymore. Well, they do, but they, they, they sell out really quickly. So if you do have a One Below near you, these ones are so bloody beautiful they're so sparkly and they're a lot like I said before they're a lot clearer you'll see from the the other gems look at the color difference now even though they're bigger the actual Poundland ones do look this color they're sort of like a blue tinge whereas these do actually look like a clear crystal and you know it works better for me so I'll be buying these from now on 
So yes, one below you win in the scatter crystals uh, section. Yeah, Woo. Um, I think I bought, how many packs did I buy? Three, yeah, three packs. Okay, so you may think I'm being crazy pants, but I bought one of the kids hoops from one below. This, this was a pound. Um, I'm actually gonna do a cake table DIY for our, our Varanual and um, I'm gonna undo all this and then paint it in a white, stick it in a block of floral foam, have some dangly ivy and some height, but bleh, some other flowers dangling down and I'm gonna do a beautiful um, flower feature and this will sit behind my cake, which is gonna be quite a simple naked uh, sponge cake with just like a cake topper that says we still do. Um, but yeah, um, this is going to be one of my favourite DIYs. I'll insert a picture just so you know what I'm talking about. Now, that is, that is exactly what I want. Um, so yeah, I'm really excited to do that. But the only problem is I can't really do it till next year because obviously it's just going to be sat around the house and it might get ruined. So, but yeah, I'll be taking the beads out. I probably didn't, wouldn't, won't have to take the beads out. I'll probably weigh it down a bit more, but... Yeah, that was the last thing I bought, guys. So, <laughs> Poundland and One Below Haul, complete. I love everything. Every I'm looking at it all now thinking, oh, I'm so excited to use stuff and decorate stuff and Halloween's coming, guys. I can't wait. So, yeah, guys, thank you so much for watching. Please don't forget to hit the subscribe button if you haven't done so already. And, yes, I love every single one of you guys you absolutely amazing amazing people hearts to you um yeah don't forget to hit the like button as well that would be awesome and i'll see you in my next video take care and happy tubing bye guys bye hey guys i'm just doing a quick recap of the video just because it was a bit blurry and you didn't get to see um much of the product so i'm just giving you a little bit of a, a close-up on everything this is that storage bag that's now in use it's huge um the candles the little wooden letters that you couldn't really see because the video was blurry the wedding sign uh, the pegs jewels varnish chalk paint uh, the candles some stuff is missing because i had to put it out and uh, in use but here's the rest of the stuff from one below most of this was blurry so I thought I would just let you see it properly this planner is absolutely gorgeous I don't know if you could see this in the video because it was blurry but it is quite it's quite nice it's quite nice and the silly little shopkin thing the fluffy yarn comb set but yeah, guys, I'm so sorry about the quality of the video again, and hopefully you can forgive me. But yeah, guys, thanks so much for watching, and take care. Bye. Mm -hmm.